You know, you might think you're watching a video game right now, but this is actually a very helpful tool to improve medical procedures. A local company is behind this gaming technology. Yeah, Evendale-based Kinetic Vision gave WCPO 9 News reporter Lisa Smith a sneak peek at how a virtual operating room could hold the secret to medical breakthroughs. It's not your typical operating room. This is our virtual operating room, and it uses two uh, really great technologies, motion capture and virtual reality combined. Kinetic Vision and Evendale spent the last few months developing the technology needed to transport researchers, doctors, and developers of medical devices into a virtual medical setting. This is a similar technology that you might see in making video games or for Hollywood movies and digital effects. What we're doing here is bringing that technology to uh, training people and testing products. Jeremy Jarrett says it developed from a need. During the pandemic, uh, we were trying to arrange some meetings in, a, in an operating room with real devices and real equipment, and it just wasn't possible. So they put their technical minds together along with several technologies and came up with a solution. A massive, massive cost savings, uh, a massive, massive time speed up, um, and uh, really um, enables also things that you could never do before. Everything happens inside this studio where the virtual becomes reality. The reaction has been uh, through the roof. Or through the goggles. Alec and Chris can only see the virtual operating room while wearing their goggles. The dots on their suits are picked up from infrared cameras, which a computer program uses to transfer them into the virtual space. Adding the real time aspect of it was the most challenging. Being able to do this live so that my body uh, is represented in, in full motion with accurate uh, fidelity um, was definitely the, the most challenging part. It works best with a full gaming suit, but as I found out, just the goggles alone work too. I can see the virtual table, virtual doctors, virtual tools, even the virtual patient. You can roll out a training platform to the world very quickly and to potential users who don't have an operating room set up yet. So it's really all of the above. Jarrett says companies are already using this technology, continuing to push the tri-state into the world of virtual innovation. Lisa Smith, WCPO 9 News.